Listening for the Promise, weekly devotional, second Sunday after Christmas, January 3rd, 2021. Why were you looking for me? Did you not know that I must be in my Father's house? Luke 2, chapter 49. When our son was about three years old, I took him to Sears to get his pictures taken. We had to wait for a while because the photographer was busy with another family. So the two of us went over to the children's department to browse the sale racks. I did not know how long he had been missing, but when I realized he was out of my sight, I panicked. Noah, 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 where are you? I looked all around that part of the store for him. Finally, I saw something move underneath a rack. I looked down, and there he was, sitting under the rack of clothes, holding his Barney doll, looking up at me with his big blue eyes. I was so relieved. He was unfazed. He knew where he was, even though I didn't. So he looked at me as if to say, I'm here, I've been here all along, what's the problem? I know I'll never forget that day, and I'm quite sure Mary and Joseph never forgot the day they were halfway home to Nazareth and realized Jesus wasn't with them. They had a better excuse than I did though. They were going home in a large group of pilgrims after having been in Jerusalem for the Passover feast. Surely they thought Jesus was with someone in the family rather than left behind at the temple. Still, I can imagine their sense of panic when they realized their son was not among the group. Imagine how they must have worried every step of the way back to the temple. When they found Jesus in the temple, he wasn't phased at all. We have to wonder if he even realized that his party had left for home. There he sat with the teachers, discussing scripture with those who were formerly trained as priests scribes, and leaders of the people. We should be shocked at the precarious, precocious nature of Jesus. After all, He is the Son of God. As Mary and Joseph approached Him, they were not happy. Why have you done this to us? We were worried sick. To which Jesus nonchalantly replied, Why were you looking for me? Did you not know I must be in my Father's house? For a moment, Jesus' parents must have forgotten that he was no ordinary kid. Of course, the Son of God would be found in his Father's house, discussing a sacred text. Surely this was a monumental moment. Used with permission from Sola Publishing.